Here's something to get the party started, a little punch. And I like to use alcohols that are slightly lower in alcohol content so that people can stay a bit within themselves when it comes to Christmas celebrations. How cool are these little ice balls? It's my orange Christmas punch. So a few slices of orange in there as well. Some lemon and some lime too. Campari is one of my favorite aperitifs. It's a great thing to have around at Christmas time as well. I mean, the color's nice, but actually it's slightly lower in alcohol than many spirits. So you can have a few enjoyable glasses of punch without getting too away from yourself. Some Grand Marnier, lovely orange flavor. It's got the bitter orange of the Campari and also the fragrant orange from the Grand Marnier. Just a touch of vermouth as well. I'll just top that off with some simple syrup. Not too much because I don't want it to be lolly water. Just enough to take the edge off the bitterness of that Campari. And then some soda water for everything else. And while I enjoy a glass of this, here's Matthew down in Tasmania with a very special Christmas entree. There's nothing quite like the personal touch of Christmas and this year I'm giving my guests my handmade teriyaki sauce, just some sake, mirin, soy sauce and sugar all dissolved together and put into a nice bottle. That's part of my Christmas but here's Peter up in Noosa to share some of his Christmas history. Merry Christmas to you all and welcome to Noosa, my new home and soon to become home of this amazing Christmas dessert. It's called Pani Pol and it has a bit of a history. In 1969 when we arrived in Sri Lanka, my mum brought all of her Austrian Christmas ideas and actually brought Christmas to our house in Colombo. First roll it nice and tight, then fold it over, and then just roll it around. And that's it. I'll make a couple more, but I just want to show you. And make you envious by trying it. Look at that. Juicy, moist, a beautiful yellow colour with no flavour at all. So that it, it makes you think, what is this thing? And then It really takes me to Christmas. It is wonderful. It's so moist and so incredibly tasty. I hope you make it and I hope you have a wonderful Christmas. Coconut pancakes, Sri Lankan style.